Hey, sis. Smell anything different about me? Yes. I'd say you were past your expiration date. God, this scent is pure gold. I switched towels with Joey the Hound. Yeah, he scores with all the babes, so I took his towel and I rubbed it all over me. That's a good start. Just add some soap and a little water, and you've got what we humans call a shower. I'm wasting my scent on you. Watch my magic work. Hello, baby. Joey? <laughs> You're not Joey. You use Joey's towel. So, uh, you want to go out with me, Muffy? <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, never. I hate you. Um, I love you. <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> Can you imagine what I'd get if I rubbed his underwear on me? Crabs. Malloy, give me my towel. Nobody uses my sensual scent for evil purposes. That smell belongs to Joey the Hound. <laughs> Ryan, when are you gonna learn that girls just want you to be yourself? Oh, yeah, that's, that's worked great for me. Please, girls, please, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Hold on to your jock towel, boy, because that girl over there is looking at you. That's Mindy Gullickson. She's a starter on the girls' basketball team. There's no time for subtlety. I better let her know I'm interested. Don't ever do that at the zoo. <laughs> oh, my God, she's getting up. She's coming over. Hiya, sweet cheek. Hi. Look, I'm really, I'm really very flattered, but I'm not that way, you see. <laughs> I play on the other team. Me too. I, uh, meant him. Unless you two are a couple. Uh, God, no. No. That's a, that's a whole other team. <laughs> Would you like to go for ice cream? Would I? You buying? Sure. All right. Well, since you're buying, then uh, maybe I should do a little something for you. You know, it is unbelievable. What could anybody see in a wiggle? <laughs> Hit the road, Jack, and don't you come back no more. So this is it. This is the yard where I grew up. Right there. That's where my mom dropped me on my head when I was a baby. Hey, a basket. You want to shoot around? <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> ah, here you go. basketball team. Yeah, the girls' team. <laughs> the girls' team? You want to play a little one-on-one? -on -one? Yeah, sure. Here you go. You can take it out. Thank you. Aren't you going to tie your shoes? Ah, no, nah, it's okay. Come on. <laughs> nice shot. That's so cute. Really, that was so cute. Time out. Good game. 
Yeah, it's great. <laughs> Don't feel bad. I am on the team. Yeah, the girls' team. You play great. A good game of basketball gets my juices going. Let's go up to your room and take a shower. Yeah! Well, I mean, that was kind of like a shower, but uh, you could take one if you want. I mean, a shower. You and me together. Wet, naked. What is your hang up with showers? I don't mean shower. Well, what do you mean? I'm not a genius, for God's sake. I want to make love to you. Oh. No, I don't want to because you beat me at basketball. Well, then let's play again and I'll let you win. Just go home, okay? I suck at football. Go. Hey, what's the matter? Uh, she beat me at basketball and I feel like less than a man. So, what's the big deal? She's on the basketball team. She's on the girls' team. It's not a real team. It's just a bunch of girls pretending to be guys. And what if she's really good? She can't be really good. She's a girl. So, then what does that make you? Well, I can still kick your butt. Yeah, but not Mindy's. <laughs> Hiya, kids. What's going on? Ryan's upset because a girl beat him at basketball. Get out of my house. No, Dad, you can't. Then I'll be the least favorite kid. Ross, you're right. And no son of mine should be embarrassed by having to wear an apron like that. Now, you give that apron to uh, that kid over there. The team, Dad. The girls' team. Daddy, shouldn't you see the girl play? I mean, maybe she's good enough to beat even a real man like you. <laughs> a girl beating a guy. <laughs> Sorry, sir. <laughs> Mr. Floppy, I, I gotta ask you something. Have you ever been beaten by a woman? Yep. <laughs> Dominatrix Burby. <laughs> Chains and leather sold separately. That's not what I meant. I'm talking about these women who try to be such great jocks. Don't they realize that the only ones turned on by that are other women? <laughs> Once and for all times. Get this straight, women. Guys don't want women who play great basketball or tennis or golf. Yeah. We want women who are fascinated by how great we play basketball, yeah. tennis, and golf. Yeah. We also want them to have a sense of humor. Not that they have to say anything funny. They just have to get our jokes. <laughs> a nice set of melons doesn't hurt either. <laughs> How about a woman who makes more money than you? If you want to buy floppy nice things, that's okay with me. Did you ever go out with a woman who made more than you? Every doll I ever met. You see a lot of me's in the toy stores? No, cause I'm too much man. People prefer that neuter boy, Elmo. Everybody is worried about protecting the youth of America. They even have a new television rating system to tell kids what they shouldn't watch. As for sex. <laughs> like, I'm not gonna tune that in. <laughs> How's mom gonna stop me? She's not allowed in my room. The only thing ratings are good for is to make sure I don't accidentally watch a family show. <laughs> they even have a rating called FV, Fantasy Violence. Think about this. The President and the Congress of the United States of America put the country on hold so they could come up with FV, fantasy violence. Hey, Big Shot, how about doing something about RV, real violence? Yeah. Real 
kids are shooting each other with real bullets, and these guys are worried about Donald Duck dropping an anvil on Wile E. Coyote. <laughs> and they wonder why nobody bothers voting. Well, here's my vote. Big government, get out of my bedroom. <laughs> so, Floppy, to sum up, you're against women in sports. Uh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> I don't like it. So, guys can't handle girls beating them at any sport? How about golf? Oh, anything that has a ball, anything at all. <laughs> Who is it? Mindy Gullickson. Wait, tell her I'm washing my hair. Tell her I'm washing my he hair. He says to tell you he's washing his hair. Get out of here. He doesn't shower. <laughs> I came back because I wasn't happy with the way we left things. Oh, you mean with get out? How about we start over? Okay. Do you want to go upstairs and take a shower? Yeah! I really don't need a shower. <laughs> Is he kidding? No. <laughs> Can you explain it to him? Pity girl, he want to pay mommy daddy with you. You mean she wants to yell at me and tell me I'm worthless? Yeah. Yeah, she probably will. Look, I mean... Oh, oh yeah! Heck yeah, I want to do that! I'm so glad. It takes a really big man not to mind losing to a girl. <laughs> yeah. Why do girls tell everything? Because we have to keep talking or we'll die. <laughs> Besides, you know, Mindy was really upset about what happened between you two, and we girls had to assure her that she's attractive, and the problem is in your pathetic male psyche. I don't care about that, don't you understand? I lost a basketball game. I mean, the sex thing is just a logical manifestation of my feelings of shame and inadequacy as a result of my failure on the court. At least that's what Dr. Shapiro, the dentist, said. <laughs> Oh, that's it. There's only one way to regain my pride. I was wondering if you wanted to come over to my house tomorrow. I'd love to. Good. Bring your sneakers. Ooh, kinky. <laughs> no. We're playing basketball. And you're all invited to come. And I'll say this right now. No girl can beat any guy at basketball when he's really trying. Matter of fact, the only thing a girl can beat a guy at is a battle for his own soul. Again, Dr. Shapiro. Ryan, he's my gynecologist. Oh, well, you seem so happy with him. Yeah, I use him too. so hard you're gonna break my nail you're the ideal girl yeah except that i can't cook oh who will have me come on shoot again shoot again i could watch a girl miss all day you know Brian, i still don't know why i invited the whole school over to watch you be humiliated I mean, if you like humiliation so much, when the game's over, try reading a book to everybody. <laughs> Tiffany, why don't you go cook me lunch? <laughs> hey, Dad. Did you hear about the rematch today? Yes, I did. And don't call me Dad. <laughs> you have any advice for me? Oh, well, all right. Come here, son. Son? It slipped out. <laughs> All right, advice on how to beat a girl. I hardly know what to tell you. Just uh, play. You know, make believe you're a guy and play like, uh, you know, like a guy. Oh, will you play a few warm games with oh, me to get me ready? No, 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 no. What if I lost? Think how I'd feel if I got beat by a guy who lost to a girl. <laughs> and if I beat you, big deal. I beat a guy who got beat by a girl. Kind of like bragging to the guys you had sex with your wife. Not exactly picking me up here, Dad. Since when is that my job? It's real important to me that you watch the game, so will you come outside and watch? Right. 
You're my blood, and I can see how much this means to you, so I'm gonna be watching from those garage windows. <laughs> and if you're winning, I'll come out. Thanks, Dad. You got it. <laughs> this can't be my fault. I raised him like a pit bull. No warmth, no love, just the occasional meal to keep him alive. <laughs> Good boy, good boy. <laughs> oh, 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 get out! Ryan Malloy, do you have the guts? Yeah, I got the guts. 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 I believe we're watching women's basketball. We have to. There's no sports on. <laughs> hey, look, they painted 500 people in the stands today. Yeah, well, it's a real important game. It's the Pennsylvania PMSers against the Oklahoma Overs. Oh, look, she missed a layup. <laughs> oh, she missed another one. <laughs> Hell, I could play better than that. You could probably be a real star in the women's basketball league. Man, I would be a, a superstar in the women's league, Floppy. I'd be on the cover of Sports Illustrated, and not just as a piece of meat in a swimsuit. <laughs> Although I wouldn't be one of them prissy broads who thought she was too good to flaunt it. <laughs> I think you'd make a lovely woman, Jack. <laughs> Nice skin, lovely eyes, good bone structure. Yeah. You need to see Dr. Booby, though. <laughs> but then you'd be perfect. Hey. Thank you, Mr. Floppy. I think any guy would be proud to call you his woman. <laughs> A butt lift and de-hair the ears, and you could be riding home with Eddie Murphy. <laughs> No, no, I think celebrities just hurt you. After all, I want to be the star of my relationship. <laughs> you know, Floppy, as much as I'd hate to be a woman, I gotta tell you, I sure would love to be a star. <laughs> Hi, guys. We got next. <laughs> Jack, what exactly were you selling? Oh, uh, these. It's not just for women anymore. Hello, I'm Tiffany Malloy, and I know nothing about basketball. I'm here with Ed O'Bannon, captain of the UCLA National Championship basketball team. And now a member of the Dallas Mavericks. Mr. O'Bannon, how would you go about beating Mindy Gullickson? Would you try to force her to the hoop? Or would you try to make her go outside? And then once she's there, have her shoot at the hoop. It's a woman. You don't need a plan. You just, just go out and play. I, I really don't understand the point of this game anyway. Guy versus a girl, you know he's going to win. But the woman wins the battle for the soul, not the ball game. Uh, thanks, Dad. High five. You take it out first. Aren't you gonna tie your shoelaces? Nah, it's okay. her shoelaces. They're a shocking pink that really clashes with her orange shorts, but somehow the whole outfit works. Three zip, baby. I can't lose. I'm on the team. There's nothing you can do about it, baby. Do you know men's basketball is a non-contact sport? 
Right, but this is women's basketball. <laughs> Man, this dude is pathetic. I'm glad he's not my son. <laughs> He doesn't have a father. The score is 10-10. Next basket wins. I don't know who the victor will be, but one thing's for certain. Only one of these players will be taking a shower after the game. <laughs> Foul! Foul? Mm -hmm. I didn't even touch you. What are you talking? <laughs> Need a maid. <laughs> 